So I'll probably show you that if I fully render it. Anyway, so here it is. Let me pause this. Here's the preview of the uh, video or whatever you're ripping. So here it is. Basically, it's already checked on the main movie. So it's just going to give you the whole entire episodes of that certain disc or the movie. And it's, but the cool thing is that it tells you the aspect ratio of the anime. So basically this is 16.9. The rest are nothing, it's just party credits, uh, extra stuff that comes in the disc. And the cool thing, you can change the language to either English, Japanese, and same with the subtitles, which is just English. I have no idea why it's like that. <coughs> uh, now, here in the bottom, at times, it's going to say DVD5, which just shows you the quality, 63%, which the file is going to be smaller. If it sometimes comes out like that, I recommend changing it to the higher quality, which would be DVD9. Uh, the formats MPEG 2 or just MPEG <laughs> so you cannot either uncheck stuff whatever language etc subtitles if you want them so the main uh, to know how to uh, to know what's the main move uh, movie look at the playing time which is the biggest one out of all of them that's the main movie, but like I said, it's already gonna be checked. So basically, you don't have to do anything else unless you want something else out of it, like the credits, opening for another, or preview for a certain other anime that comes in the disc. Now, we go to next. Uh, nothing really uh, special about this, so just gotta next. <clears throat> Sorry if the video's long. I get, you know, I don't mean to mumble that, but it just happens. I, you know, kind of get into it. But anyways, it's gonna say um, all this stuff, copying, blah blah blah. Here's the percentage, the timing. But anyways, I could say, um. I have a full I'm working on, which is the bleach. Uh, Dana, you already know what it is, which I'm going to show it afterwards if I have rendered or not. Like, whatever I have so far. But, anyways, another. I guess I could tell you what happened to me last week on Monday, which is really random. Um, here, my cousin. Basically went to a store. I'm not sure if any of you know what Best Buy is. Which oh, it's not Best Buy, but um, the store is called Fry's Electronic. Basically, it's just an electronic store. You know, TVs, computers, games, etc. So we went. We took the long way to get there. We went on bikes. Afterwards, when we were going back, there was this roadway going to this uh, school called Estancia. Uh, so what? Once we started, like we're in, like five, ten minutes into the road, my cousin asked me, hey, "Ivan, have you ever been like into this road riding it?" I'm like, no, why? I'm like, cause I haven't. So basically, we went into it where he said, I asked him, he was sure just the uh, right way. And he never has ever been into that road. So basically, I'm like, fuck. You know, how, how do we know where this is going to take us to Estancia? It's like, well, I don't know, just, just keep going. So we kept on going. The first time, okay, we went the downhill. And then we're supposed to go here to go to get to this bridge. Because it was straight ahead. We saw it straight ahead. So we went down, the gate was closed, I'm like, oh my god, Maurice. Well, I call him Michael, 
because he's that's his nickname. Um, afterwards, we were lucky enough there's a road up to get to the bridge, so we went up. We went to the bridge, uh, past the bridge, and afterwards, he's like, "Wait, hold up! This is, this is not the way. We're supposed to go to the other bridge." So we turn around. That's the second time we took the wrong turn. Got lost. So we turn around. We're going straight. Now here's the funny part. Another funny part. We we're going the right way. They like, they like, they like. Ivan, we're supposed to go down there. It's like, so we have to go back. So I'm like, I, I asked him, "Are you sure?" He's like, "Yes." But lucky, he's like, lucky enough, there's a like little hill thing to go down. Okay, so we turn around. We, we see the hill thing going down. All right, my cousin goes down first. And since we're like supposed to be careful because it's kind of dangerous. and But he walks down fast. I'm like, Michael, I'm not, I'm going to die here. I'm like fucking scared. I'm like, honestly, I was scared to go down. So what I did first, threw down my bike, it didn't reach all the way down, it only went halfway. So my cousin goes back up and gets it, he's like, come on, hurry up. I'm like, alright, so I start going down, then I sit on my ass and start, you know, scraping down for a bit. He's like, oh good, I'm like, I even get up, otherwise I'm going to record this and upload it to YouTube. So I'm like, fuck you. So I get up and start going down before he starts recording, like, you lucky, he's like, you lucky bastard. <coughs> Then along with him, he had with actor recorder and uploaded to YouTube. Anyway, so we get down, we're riding, it's like, I'm not paying attention, I'm like just looking down. Because I was like, I was just thinking to myself, damn, how long is this road? After it's like, I even see, pokes at me because he was like close, right, we're riding a bike. <clears throat> it's like, look, straight ahead, it's like, what? I'm like, he's like, the gate is closed, we can't go out I'm like oh my fucking god and I hit him afterwards the gate was closed and there's a way to go in the middle but since my cousin's skinny and I'm a big guy so he goes through and I'm like Maurice I'm not be I'm not gonna be able to go down I mean go through because I'm a big guy it's like just climb over okay I tend to climb over but since the gate <coughs> starts moving I couldn't so okay here I throw the I throw my bike over, which luckily is not that uh, 